welcome to the mathematics in my channel today we are going to solve another interesting integral integral from 0 to 5 over 4 natural log of sine of x dx well first I'm going to take this is equal to i and now I am going to define an integral g is equal to 0 to 5 over 4 natural log of cosine of x dx now we can take i plus j so if we take i plus j we can write 0 to 5 over 4 natural log of sine of x dx plus 0 to 5 over 4 natural log of cosine of x dx and now same limit so we can write 0 to 5 over 4 natural log of sine of x plus natural log of cosine of x but we know property of natural log so we can write here natural log of sine of x cosine of x dx now 0 to 5 over 4 natural log of we know um, double angle formula sine of 2 times theta is equal to 2 times sine of x uh, cosine of x so now we can write here sine of 2 time, times x over 2 dx now again we can apply property of natural log so we can write 0 to 5 over 4 natural log of sine of 2 times x dx minus 0 to 5 over 4 natural log of 2 dx now for this integral for this integral I'm going to use substitution method so if we take 2 times x is equal to u now 2 times dx is equal to du and limit lower limit when x approaches to 0 u approaches to also 0 upper limit when x approaches to 5 over 4 u approaches to yeah x instead of x we can plug in 5 over 4 so 5 over 2 now we can write here limit 0 to 5 over 2 natural log of sign up now 2 times x is equal to u dx is equal to du over 2 so du 1 over 2 we know constant so we can write outside of the integral sign and here natural log of 2 is a constant and integral of dx we know x from 0 to 5 over 2 well now here we can write uh, this integral this is familiar with us uh, if you like to watch this uh, solution of this integral I will make a card and also I will add the link in the description so we know this is equal to minus pi over 2 natural log of 2 here natural log of 2 now if we plug in upper limit so here pi over 2 ah sorry here 5 over 4 so here also 5 over 4 and here also 5 over 4 I apologize you so here now here we have minus 5 over 4 natural log of 2 here also minus 5 over 4 natural log of 2 
so we can simplify so we can write here this is equal to minus pi over 2 natural log of 2 now we know this is equal to pi plus j and we can take this is equation number 1 then I am going to take i minus j so if we take i minus j we can write 0 to pi over 4 natural log of sine of x dx minus 0 to phi over 4 natural log of cosine of x dx now same limit so we can take one integral sign so 0 to phi over 4 now natural log of sine x minus natural log of cosine of x so according to property of natural log we can write natural log of sine of x over cosine of x dx now we can write we know sine of x over cosine of x is equal to tan of x dx now for this integral I'm going to take Uh, u is equal to tan of x so x is equal to arc tan of u now dx is equal to 1 over 1 plus u square du now we can plug in here so now limit when x approaches to 0 u also approaches to 0 when x approaches to 5 over 4 tan of pi over 4 we know 1 so 0 to 1 natural log of tan of x u uh, dx is equal to 1 plus u square here du well now we know um, yeah we can expand using infinite geometric series 1 over 1 plus u square so we can write 0 to 1 natural log of u infinite sum 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n u to the 2 times n du ok now we can write uh, this uh, sigma notation outside of the integral sign so we can write n is equal 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n power integral from 0 to 1 u to the 2 n natural log of u du well now we have another integral so now we can use by parts method so now we can write i minus j i minus j is equal to uh, infinite sum 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n power integral 0 to 1 uh, i write natural log of u as a first function and d by du here yeah, integral of second function so we know u to the 2n so u to the 2n plus 1 over 2n plus 1 here yeah, du now we can write infinite sum minus 1 to the n power yeah product of these two functions so natural log of u u to the 2n plus 1 over 2n plus 1 uh, here uh, from 0 to 0 to 1 
and then here not bracket and minus integral from 0 to 1 integral from 0 to 1 u to the 2n plus 1 power over 2n plus 1 times derivative of natural log of u 1 over u du then infinite sum 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n power here bracket and if we plug in 1 natural log of 1 0 if we plug in 0 here 0 so this is going to 0 so 0 minus now here 2n plus 1 is a constant so we can write outside of the integral sign and here we can write 0 to 1 u to the 2n plus 1 minus 1 so u to the 2 n power du well then 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n power and here minus sign so we can write minus sign here and 1 over 2n plus 1 times now integral of u to the 2n we know u to the 2n plus 1 over 2n plus 1 from 0 to 1 then minus infinite sum minus 1 to the n power here if you plug in 1 so 1 over 2n plus 1 if you plug in 0 0 so 1 over 2n plus 1 square okay now this is familiar with us because we know this is equal to Catalan constants so then uh, our first equation so here this is our second equation and our first equation i plus j now we need to i so i am going to take 1 plus 2 so we can write 2 times i is equal to uh, here minus 5 over 2 natural log of 2 minus here g catalan's constant so i is equal to minus 5 over 2 here 2 so 5 over 4 minus 5 over 4 natural log of 2 minus g over 2 okay this is the answer if you like this video please subscribe this channel thank you for watching